Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. This is Nine Flusion, and let's play some more Factorio. So, what were we doing last time? Uh, I can't remember. It's been a couple of days, actually. I did a batch of recordings and then kind of went away for a little while, and I can't quite remember what I was doing, but I'm sure it was good. So, what we do need to do, it's probably the first order of business, really, is get our science production properly automated. Because right now we're just running off a single lamp, which is fed directly by those assembly machines. How are we doing on power? Power is okay. Yeah, we've still got a bit of space there. We have expanded that recently, so that's not too bad. And there's turrets and stuff over there. That's defended. Will I put any turrets down here? I should probably put some turrets down there as well, shouldn't I? Let's do that first, because I've got a bunch of ammo on me. I'll make a couple of turrets, just make sure... Ooh, little autosave going on. We'll make sure that the copper production down here is uh, defended protected. Especially if we're going to be working up here. By the time I run all the way down here everything will be blown up and eaten by the damn biters. Although we haven't detected any biters down in this direction yet. Which is good, to be honest. I'm I'm not complaining about that, don't get me wrong. Uh, I'm actually going to put the turrets kind of here. And you can have a bunch of ammo. And there we go, there's a second one done. And we'll put another one here. Even a single turret will be pretty good against early wave biters. But if we look at our map, so far the only biter bases we've spotted are up this area. So we are playing with full normal settings on this playthrough. So this field, while quite big, is actually there's not actually that much ore here. But it's okay. And we're trying to make our main bus kind of run in this direction, which does mean we're going straight for a forest, which is a bit of a problem. I'm going to have to do a lot of felling of trees at some point. But anyway, all right, let's start doing some science. I'm going to run science down this way. So what am I going to need for that? Let's see. I am going to want... Hmm. What am I going to want? What do I need, guys? I'm going to need some science labs for a start. Let's get some assembly machines made. I've got four assembly machines already. Got a bunch of inserters, but we're going to definitely need more. Going to need some of those. Okay. And uh, we're going to need some of those as well. Luckily, my little assembly machine making the yellow belts for me is just chugging along quite happily. In fact, I think that's probably a full chest. Yep. There's another 200 in there. I've got a couple of hundred on me. We're all pretty good there. I can probably actually dump some of this stuff. Have I got a, a jump, a uh, junk chest anywhere? It's something you inevitably end up doing, is just having a chest where you put all the old stuff you no longer want. So, we don't need that gun. We don't need those burner mining drills anymore. Um, yeah, that'll do okay. We'll just leave those in there. I don't want to throw them away just yet. I could shoot it and destroy it, but it seems a bit unnecessary. So, we want to make red signs, so that needs copper plate and iron gear wheels. Okay, that's not too complicated, he says, somewhat grudgingly. We're going to need... This is where I start getting complicated. It's I've got to try and figure out on my feet what I'm doing. So we want to make iron gear wheels, which means I need to get some iron down to here, and onto a belt feeding into machines which are making science. Okay, bear with me. I'm very bad at this game. I did say this at the start. Okay, I know what I'm doing. Don't worry. I'm going to want some fast inserters as well at some point. Okay, so you will make me iron gear wheels, and you will make me science. And there is a plan here, don't worry. Oh, hang on. I need to get... Okay, no, I can do this. Um, which way is that going to deploy? Let's test this. I want to put the gear wheels and the copper plates on the same line if I can. And then have my outflow over here, maybe? Yeah, I think that'll work. So you just need some iron. So we can split that off. Here. Turn that that way. 
bring that under the copper belt and there we go, you've got a feed of iron coming in, you're going to deploy it onto there and then we're going to take half of our copper, which is probably a bit much, but it'll just fill up the belt that's going to come from both sides, because I've put it on both sides here damn it, that's not what I wanted that's not what I needed how do I do this? Hmm. Okay, I've got to think for a moment. Thinking, thinking, thinking. See, I like factory. I'm just not very good at thinking about how I'm meant to actually lay out the factory. And I end up making these really bad layouts that I'm sure people are going to hate. Is there any way to get that stuff? Oh, okay, oh, yeah, I can see it. I'm going to actually break it there. because I'm going to do something a bit silly. No, no, damn it. Oh, you're not going to let me do what I want, are you? There we go. I managed to do it. So we've got a single line of copper coming through. Yes, it looks messy, but like I said, I'm not good at this. Have I got any electric poles? I don't. Make some more electric poles. Sometimes you use so many of these things, it's almost worthwhile. Ooh. It's almost worthwhile having them made for you somewhere. But not quite, because they're so easy to make. Okay. So the plan is now simple. We're just going to have a bunch of factories going up this way, which will make red signs for us, picking off the belt here. It actually works quite nicely. But we definitely want you to go faster. We want all the gears. So there we go. And I'm going to need some more assembly machines. Make a bunch of those. And there you go. See, red signs is coming off already. And at some point I'll need to figure out how I'm going to get green signs onto this layout. What does green signs need? Tra inserters and transport belt. How am I going to get that? Hmm, okay. We'll work that out later. Oop, too far away. There we go. I think we want, if we have five labs to start off with. There we go. You can all deploy onto there. I'm just going to keep running this down. And we're going to make some more science labs to go on the end. But I'm going to need some more stuff for that. I should have spaced those out a bit, shouldn't I? Damn it. Okay. Need a little bit of space for my power poles because I'm still using just the little ones. But at least I can get two for two. Nope, let me get a little bit closer. There we go. Tell you to start making red signs for me. There we go. Okay, this is good. We're getting there. We're getting there slowly but surely. Going to put one more on there. Bring that down a little bit further. A little bit further still. There we go. So we've got five assembly machines making that. That should be able to keep up with the demand, really. I hope. We'll see. And yet, yeah, Red Science is building up nicely. I did make some labs, didn't I? Yeah, I did. But I was going to get more stuff for them. Well, let's get those first two down. Nope, missed. There we go. Okay. Right, extra science. Good. I can go disassemble the other section in a minute. Let's empty this off, shall we? What else do I need? That'll give me enough for eight more. Alright. While that's going, that's going to finish off our bullet damage for us. I'm going to go grab the other ones from up by the power area. 
I only put it over here because it was right next to the power and I hadn't put any power lines down yet. And it has stopped because it's run out of iron for the gear wheels. That's okay. There we go. How are you guys doing on coal? You actually are looking a bit low. Let's fill you guys up for the time being. I don't need to. Why did I do that? There's actually... I forgot I've already automated that. I did say I'm terrible at this game. Don't blame me. Fine. We'll have a bit more coal on us. That was actually a bit too much coal. Fine. I need to shoot that rock eventually. Right. Science labs. I've got a bunch on me now. You can go there and we'll run more on that side. Is that another one being made? No. Got how many more being made? Yep. Yeah. We'll have eight science labs to start off with. Okay. We'll just have to double up on power poles here, unfortunately. Not the neatest thing I've ever done, but nothing ever is. Bring this belt on down. There we go. Just got to wait for these last two labs to be done. We're getting there slowly but surely. Look at all the science we're doing now, though. That will be done very quickly, hopefully. Got another lab to go. That doesn't actually need to be that far up. I've got to... Can I make bigger power poles yet? No, okay, we've got to work on that. We need some bigger power poles. And the last science lab is done. Okay, that's eight science labs, all being fed automatically by this lovely little assembly line system here. There we go, bullet damage one is done. Um, I wouldn't mind heavy armour. It's quite expensive to make. Or do we want... No, can't do that because that needs green science. Bullet shooting speed, that would actually be a good one to do. So we'll have the damage increase and we'll have the shooting speed increase, which I think will work out good for us. Okay, so that's all going down there. That's more than we actually need, I think. I could probably actually get another couple of labs on there, but we'll worry about that later. I do want to get some walls being made, though. So what we can do... Drop that there. Drop that there. We're going to need another power pole, because it's out of range. Power poles just go everywhere. And you should be able to make me walls automatically. Excellent. Okay, I've got to get inserters made automatically soon. There we go. We don't want too many walls. So we're just going to let that carry on. But there's a nice backlog of stuff in there. You do need some more fuel because you're not getting fuel automatically. Would be kind of pointless if you were. Cool. Okay, I'm going to leave that running for a bit. But walls are good. They help keep out the biters. The biters who love to make a mess. So, automated science. We are going to have to need to look into green science soon, which is going to need... So we do need to make inserters automatically. Right, let's start doing that, shall we? What do I need to do inserters automatically? Electronic circuits, iron gear wheels, and iron plate. Okay, I can do this. I've done this before. I don't think I've ever got past green science. Partially because... I just get very confused about what I'm trying to do all the time. So, we're going to want... Where do we... We're going to want the, gr the green science to be made here. Yeah. So that means we're going to need inserters and transport belt coming in that way. Like so. So I want to make all the stuff up here, and I think just use some underground belt. Which is running the wrong way, I know. Why are you running the wrong way? Turn around. There we go. Nope. Hang on. There we go. Nope. Hang on. Alright, now it's running the wrong way. Sorry, that bit, that was confused me. So I've got my inserters being made over here. I can move that down fairly easily. It's not a complicated process. Um, I do want to keep my little buffer there, though. That's kind of handy to have. I could always input that onto another line. Uh, sorry, output it onto another line running up this way and come down there. 
Hmm. Which is the best way to do this? We've got gears being made here. What do inserters need again? They need a bunch of stuff. Electronic circuits. So I need to get electronic circuits being made, which requires copper. Is it just copper for that? Electronic circuits, iron plate, and copper cable. Okay, I need to think about this for a minute. So I'm going to call this episode here while I plan out what I'm trying to do. Oh, bullet shooting speed is done. Let's get some improved... No, let's not do improved armor. I wouldn't mind... Hmm. Yeah, we'll do electronics. That will get us the better electrical poles. And also smart inserters, which I've never used yet. But anyway, I'm going to call this episode here. Um, think about how I'm going to sort out my green science. So, thank you very much for watching. I hope you're enjoying this. Uh, do leave a like, leave a comment, feel free to subscribe, and hopefully I'll see you later. Bye!